hi friends uh, in this uh, video session I want this is going to be a very quick session on database diagrams uh, which is a part of SQL server but uh, I mean rarely used by the modeling modelers so uh, I what I want uh, to show is uh, how database diagrams will be helpful to you for, for modeling your database at the initial phases of your development so I have an adventure works uh, Microsoft adventure works uh, database so I'll just create a, a diagram okay so uh, it will give you the option to select tables so let me select all of them the complete table and add it right now if you look at this oh my god I think my system is hanged okay so if you look at this okay this is a better way you just hover your mouse on uh, this and then you can actually go ahead and check all the tables so it's a SQL server has done its best to arrange these tables in the uh, uh, format it a uh, way it could so but if you, you we can actually go ahead and, and rearrange them the best I mean uh, in the way we can so uh, so let me again hover my mouse and hold it so these are the tables which are not connected to anything and the others you can find there is a, a relation I mean if you hover your mouse you will get all the uh, references that is uh, happening on the table so you can and if you want to add a new table you can say add a new table this will actually add the table in the diagram as well as in your database so that's uh, that's again an option I leave uh, you to explore with this was uh, just I wanted to show how you could and, and say if you model this database arranged the complete diagram the way you wanted to and now what you want to do is share it with uh, adventure works okay and share and you want to share it with your business uh, then how would you do it uh, so if you click anywhere in this table this is the t uh, you wish uh, to j remove you if you want to create the uh, schema changes that can also be done and if you want to create a, a new uh, primary key or set maybe different constraints that can also be done apart from that you can click anywhere apart from the table and the blank space and then you can say copy this diagram to keep clipboard that's an important and now uh, I open my paint and control V so the complete picture of uh, the database is uh, is now have been pasted to your uh, and now uh, uh, to your paint and now you can save this data uh, save this file uh, in your JPG format or whatever way you wish to and then maybe uh, share it with your team uh, development team or your business team or whatever so so that's an excellent way uh, to not only uh, 
model your database but also uh, also sharing uh, the same with uh, once it is modeled and freezed so that's uh, I think that's going to really uh, be helpful to you uh, and uh, to the development team and as well as the uh, modelers database modelers uh, so thank you friends I hope this is uh, this video is helpful to you